Uh, okay guys, this is a really short video. Just a quick demonstration of the iCarsoft i910, uh, giving you a, a little bit of information about how to retrieve O2 sensor data. So that's data from your uh, oxygen or your lambda sensors. Now it is quite common that uh, a lot of vehicles will have more than one oxygen sensor. So we're just going to show you how to read the live data from this uh, from this part of the engine. All right, so we're going to click on engine here. We're just working our way, finding our specific vehicle. And we'll come to an option where it'll allow us to read any fault codes. Uh, it'll also give us an option to read live data, and that's what we need to do. So we'll just OK to this, and then we'll come down to read data stream so that's the live data section and now it's going to give us lots of different options with regards to live data in this vehicle uh, so what you really need to do it gives you lots of uh, sort of useful information it's not just the information from the o2 sensors it'll give you but that's what we're looking for so you need to find out what the uh, specific limits for your vehicle should be for the o2 sensors and then come on to this kit here and find out what your actual readings are. Just scrolling down to get the correct bits of information on screen. So you've got Lambda Controller, Lambda Controller. And there you are. So that is what we'll do is we'll scroll down as well just to show you the rest of the pages or live data that you would be able to get. And there we go, so that's the live data including the live O2 sensor data. Uh, this is the iCarsoft i910, it is available just by clicking the link below this video. Or you can visit the website www.diagnostic-world.com. Thanks for watching and I hope this video helps.